Hey guys, so I've been promising for a while that I would show you my new bed setup here. Um, and so now it's set up as a little uh, pit group type sofa as you can see. Um, what I'm going to do is take this extra piece I've got and stick in here and go ahead and complete the bed so you can see that you know it makes a bed. Um, that stows back here. And then uh, you just take this piece Stick it in here like this. Now my extra cushion that I store over here goes in place. And uh, there you have a sturdy bed for two. Um, all right, so now I'm going to go ahead and remove this piece and then fold these pieces up so that you can see that these indeed go out of the way completely so that you can use the rest of the trailer for whatever purpose you want to use it for. Okay, so uh, here you can see this one is just uh, a bench, and this one is kind of L-shaped here. So uh, when, you, when it comes time to get rid of them, uh, you just lift it up. Uh, these legs under here are folding. They uh, fold up and lock, like that. And then uh, my ultra simple system is just these, uh, these super quick clamps here. Take one of those, clamps up to the back wall there. That's not going anywhere. And uh, this leaves this L-shaped one. Now keep in mind that I can fold this one up and just use this one or just that one, whichever I want. Uh, I've got a little table that fills in the spot however the, ca the, uh, the little sofa is set up. So this one can give you a little bit better shot, I think, of the folding legs. Um, I bought these, they were a good bit longer, and I just used a pipe cutter and cut them down to the size that I wanted. So as you can see, these legs fold down pretty easily, and then they lock closed so that they don't shift around. And uh, this one does the same thing as the other. Um, you just sort of clamp it up here. Well, I'm having problems with this clamp, but as you can see, now the bed is completely out of the way. Um, this also gives us enough uh, information, uh, enough time to show you the inside of the little uh, air conditioner here that people have asked me about. This is, of course, the working side of it. And then what I've done here is I have, uh, I have uh, just cut a hole in the uh, side of the trailer, and then this is a piece of thick marine grade plywood, and it's bolted all the way through. And then it goes out like a diving board, kind of, and it's got the rest of the air conditioner unit sitting on top of it. Um, I'll walk us around so that you can see the outside of it. Um, sorry for the bad camera quality. Just bear with me here. So that's the outside of it right there where it comes through. Um, I've got it bordered in some stainless steel. It's a little bit dirty right now because it's fall outside. But uh, there you go. There's the edge of the marine grade plywood coming through. And it's been very sturdy. I haven't worried about being on any country dirt roads or anything like that. It's not going to mess with it. It, it works great. So uh, thanks a lot for viewing. Hope you get some ideas.